this is a game that needs actually a lot of introduction. This is My Little Pony vs. StarCraft, also known as My Little Pony vs. Toho, also known as Bullet Hell Ponies, also known as the creator really needs to decide on a name and stick with it. So, yeah, this is My Little Pony and a Bullet Hell game, pretty much. So yeah, there's six... Whoa, they changed the character! Holy shit. Okay. So, there's six characters here, and, um... He apparently changed Twilight. Twilight used to have the worst attack ever, and she now has not the worst attack ever, apparently. So, yeah, you get six characters. They all attack slightly different. And you can read what it says on the right there. The... The interface continues with that thing on the right the whole game, by the way. I really don't know why. So, you've got a normal attack, which is this, and you've got the shift attack, where you're in focus mode and you move slower, and you your attack is slightly different. It's generally more focused. I honestly don't know what the hell it's supposed to do with Rainbow Dash. It just makes it sparklier, which, um, just, it just says in focus mode. Rainbow Flash is 20% cooler. If it actually does anything, please let me actually know that. Don't just say, oh, it does. it's 20% cooler. Just say, like, it does 20% more damage, or whatever you're trying to express there, I don't get it. But, um, yeah. There are six characters. We're gonna play as Rarity, because she's fucking awesome, and she kills stuff. Which is really the only important thing in being awesome. And we're gonna play in Philly mode, which is basically easy mode. So I'm slightly drunk. Someone has stolen Equestria. What? That that was pretty much my response. What are you talking about? This is horrible. Oh no! What? <laughs> what are you doing? Your expression is odd, Pinkie Pie. We have to take it back. We have to take back this land because it's been stolen, apparently. Which doesn't make sense. Yes, Rainbow Dash says, because she's on LSD. At all the time. So much LSD. And Applejack is eating apples because she's a damn hillbilly. And we don't like Applejack. Let's go save Equestria, yeah! So we're freaking... We're rarity, and that's pretty awesome. And we kill stuff. She's got short range attack and she kills stuff. Pretty awesome. So our ponies go to defend Equestria from the giant cloud attack. Oh god. The giant cloud... Okay, the giant cloud is gone. Equestria is saved. We can all go home. Let's all go home. Oh. It's a video game. Okay. Slight change of plans. Slight change of plans. And if I get a game over, it's because I'm drunk. Okay. I... That... That is the only possible reason. I've beaten this game before, but... Um... I tried to record this twice. Didn't fucking work. That was also a month ago. But, um... Yeah, I didn't want to play this game ever again, because I played it twice on camera, and it didn't record, but... And if it doesn't record this time, I'm gonna cry and murder people. Possibly at the same time. Whoa. So, he's like... Okay, my original complaint that it was this game had nothing to do with bullet hell, aside from there being lots of bullets on the screen, but... The bullets weren't quite in the bullet hell type pattern. It's kind of doing that now. Also, these bosses finally decided to be hard, which is amazing because these bosses were like pathetically retarded before, like clinically retarded. Even though retardate retardation is not a clinical term, these were so retarded that it became clinical and how retarded they were. Also, these fucking shadow bolt thingies that are all bubbly and shit, the smoky bullet effect, that is not good for a bullet hell game. With bullet hell games, you want a very clear silhouette for the bullets. When you don't do that, it's not a bullet hell game. And let's be fucking Fluttershy, because we're stupid. Fluttershy it shoots butterflies out of her face, which is kind of cool, but kind of stupid. Oh, this is not good. My goodness, what is that? It's the health bar staying over my face, which is really ugly. That's what that is, Fluttershy. And I apologize, but I can't do anything to fix it. Battercruiser Observational. 
I have no time to play with you because I'm a poorly drawn, weird, creepy guy. But you have to tell me what's going on, I mean, if it's not too much trouble. There's a health bar proceeding into my face. Please fix this. Your world has an abundance of friendship. Our planet needs it. Your planet needs a face, sir. Then let's all just be friends. Shut up, Fluttershy. Just... I should have been Rarity. Rarity wouldn't have been this this stupid. It is a more efficient for our friends... Our us to siphon it from yours. You can't siphon friendship. I tried. I tried, okay? It just, it did not work. But, but, I'm a stupid pony. This interference has gone on too long. In guard. This game just became awesome. That is Guile's theme. This game just became awesome. The game didn't used to have that. Oh god. Also, the game Im greatly improved the boss attack graphics. They didn't used to look very good, I guess. Also, a big problem with this game is that, okay, you press square button to use magic. And all of the magic sucks. It really sucks. And it's terrible. Fluttershy blows away bullets because she sucks, so she blows. Uh, uh, I don't know where I was going with that. Um, anyway, magic really sucks. So that's all I was really trying to say there. So, did I just say square button? It's mapped to the square button on my PlayStation controller, but since I'll be using a keyboard, I don't know why I said that. Let's see Pinkie Pie. She does not suck in this context. Kind of. She's okay in this context, anyway. Oops. So yeah, this game is pretty hard to do actually dodge bullets like a bullet hell game, but it gives you ridiculous amounts of health. So it's kind of okay. Kind of. Let's kill stuff. I should. That's pretty much. I should be built my opening for every video game ever. Let's kill stuff. Aw oh, crap, we're the redneck pony. This is not gonna end well. We, we're from the south and we're a redneck. That's, that's all I have to say about Applejack, really. We, we shoot apples. And we're a redneck. That's why we shoot apples, actually. What was that? That sure wasn't no confederate flags. I don't understand what that was about. Siphon and friendship, what in the hell is that supposed to mean? That's exactly what I said. It doesn't make any damn sense. You're you're making sense, which is odd for how much of a redneck southerner you are. Anyway, I don't like how Applejack works in this game because she she Okay, so her charge her shift attack is she charges up apples, but there's no indication of how many apples you've stored up. So, we're going to be Rarity because she doesn't suck, unlike Applejack. And this level got like a billion times harder because originally if you killed those egg thingies, they wouldn't shoot bullets at you, but now they do. It's still not very hard, but it's 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 certainly different. Anyway, I don't know what these are. I, I've never played StarCraft. I've seen friends of mine played StarCraft. I didn't... It didn't have very much appeal. I do not like Blizzard, I must say that. Not a fan of Blizzard, and I'm not generally a fan of RTSs in general. But, uh, yeah. This game is apparently related to StarCraft, so... Allegedly, all of these enemies are from StarCraft. If you played StarCraft, you can judge that for yourself. I have absolutely no idea how these relate to StarCraft. I'm gonna call these Zerg, because they're alien things. And I know that Zergs are alien things in StarCraft, so... That seems like a sound assumption. Anyway, these Zergs are like, shitting their own babies at us, which is... Disgusting in multiple... Contexts. It's just disgusting. Also, these homing bullets are pretty annoying. But... They're not that hard to dodge. One problem I have with this game is that mostly dodging bullets is all about moving away from bullets. In bullet hell games, that's not generally how it works. No, it's more of a Xevious type game. No, wait, Xevious, it's not. What am I trying to say? What is that game? Um. Crap. Maybe I'm trying to say Xevious. It's that really hard scroller shooter thing. Oh, what is that? It's a. Your, your guess is as good as mine, Rarity. I don't know what the hell that is. 
How horrid. You're as drunk as I am, I see, Rarity. That's... That's probably not good. Please, Mondra Merit. You look badass, Rarity. But... I'm not sure why you're doing that, but you look pretty badass. Please mind your horrid manners and speak properly to a lady. Why are you covered with mud? Did that thing just barf on me? It's fucking on! I'm gonna kick your fucking ass. I'm going to rip you apart and eat your face. Because that's... That is how a lady treats... treats Whatever the fuck you are. I don't... I don't know what you are. But I'm gonna cut you apart and feed you to my cat. That... That is how a lady would handle this situation. I think. If there are any ladies in the audience, please... Tell everyone else that this is how you would handle this situation. Because I'm pretty sure it is. The Gals theme is still awesome. Also, Rarity is actually not the optimal choice for this boss because these stupid balls make it very hard to attack close range. And Rarity is all about close range attacks for some reason. But she's still awesome and she does ridiculous amounts of damage. So even if it's not the best idea, we're going to play as her. Because she's awesome and she kills... Oops. As I was saying, why did you not die? You have no health. I hate you. And so, our ponies failed to defend Equestria from alien invasion. Well, that's stupid. We already got wet for some reason. We already likes to get wet. Oh, well. Let's... Fuck it. Let's play it in derpy mode. I'm not... I'm not playing this again. I've played this game too many times. Someone is... Okay, you've heard this crap before. We're gonna kill stuff. Then it's gonna be easier this time. Like, seriously, I tried to play this, like, right around when I got my new job, which was, like, two fucking months ago. And it didn't record because this game is full screen, and I don't know why it didn't record, but it didn't. And honestly, I never wanted to play this game again. But then he updated the game, and somebody asked that I play this stupid thing. So you know what, I'm playing the stupid game. And it's a bullet hell game, so I don't generally mind playing it, but... Playing bullet hell games on camera is different than just playing it for fun. Because I have to do well, and I have to not fail constantly. And bullet hell games are all about making you fail constantly. Oh crap! I didn't want to do it Pinkie Pie style, okay? I wanted to do it Rarity style. That's... That is... That is what I'm into. I'm into Rarity style. You can... You can read into that however you want to. Kill this bullet hell. This is... This is Baby Town Frolics. Okay, I know I picked the super retarded mega easy mode, but still. I'm still making fun of you for being easy. Because that's how I roll. Also, don't play bullet hell games when you're drunk, kids. This is what happens. This is what happens when you find a stranger in the Alps. It is. It's, it's pretty terrifying, let me tell you. It's, it's horrifying. Also, magic attacks fucking suck. Oh, wait. Okay. That was a bad time to remind you the magic attacks suck because it worked. But generally speaking, the magic attacks suck in this game. I forgot to mention, magic attacks, that purple bar there in front of Pinky's face, that is your magic bar. When your magic bar goes over a certain percent, you start attacking better, your normal attack gets stronger. So when you use magic, your normal attack gets weaker. So it sucks. So the magic in this game sucks. That's that's about all I can say about it. I've got a bad feeling about this because I suck. Twilight, you just... Whoa. Your eyes are not supposed to do that, Twilight. Just calm down. I know it's a poorly drawn battle cruiser driver guy. To just calm down. Yeah, look badass like that. That's, that's what you should do in this situation. Look badass. What have you done to our world? You made it all green and grassy. We do not like green grass. We are ponies and we... Don't eat grass. What do, what what do ponies eat? I don't, I don't know. I assume they eat the same thing as horses, but I don't know what horses either. They probably eat grass, actually. So, you know, friendship is made through being kind to one another. You know what? Your face is made from being ugly. Are you crazy? Yes, he's crazy. Yes, he's crazy. So is everything in this entire game. But. 
That's neither here nor there. Actually, it's exactly here nor there. This is the entire game. Okay, and again, the shadowy silhouettes suck for bullet hell games. They're supposed to be about precise dodging. Which, while drunk, is very hard. But still. Let's be Fluttershy, because... Twilight is not very good in this game. But Fluttershy is not good against bosses. She's good against normal enemies, because she's got, like, crazy spread attacks. Fluttershy likes spreading it. What can, what can I say? She's, she's that kind of person. Or pony, or whatever you want to say. And we're Twilight again, because I'm Waron. This is unfortunate. But whatever. This game is ridiculously easy, because enemies do not hurt us, like, at all. Let's just... Okay, that attack still sucks. My problem with, with Twilight's magic attack is that it drains all of your fucking magic. That is excessive. So her attack requires precise aiming because you've got to hit it straight on them and it does ridiculous damage. The problem is it does too much damage, so it's very excessive. And so you never want to use all of it. So it's just... Twilight's magic attack sucks, that's, that's all I can say. What was that? I'm cross-eyed, because I'm, I'm derpy now. I'm derpy, derp, derp. Siphoning in our friendship? I don't get it. You don't get it because it doesn't make any damn sense. This game... Even for a game about magical ponies flying through the sky, this game's plot is kind of... nonsensical. Which is impressive. Anyway, let's be anyone else but Fluttershy. I mean, Twilight. I mean, whoever the hell we are. Let's be a character we haven't been before. Let's be Rainbow Dash, even though I hate her in this game. She's got the generic laser attack, which is not good for this game. Because, like, okay, the nice thing about laser is that it instantly hits your enemies, and even, and it penetrates. Fluttershot, or er, Twilight, I mean, Rainbow Dash. Rainbow Dash likes penetration. I can't, I can't even make a terrible joke, I'm sorry. Rainbow Dash likes penetration, so she uses lasers. It's... It's, it's, it's exactly as disturbing as it sounds, and I, I apologize for that. But yeah. Oh, these cards, by the way? They replenish your magic. We're playing fucking Magic the Gathering. And the game froze for a second there. So we're playing Magic the Gathering, and cards replenish the magic. Even though I don't think even that happens even in Magic the Gathering. You need, like, specific cards for it. I played exactly three games of Magic the Gathering. No, wait. I probably played like two, and I had no idea what was going on in any of them. So, I don't know. I don't know where I was going with that. Anyway, let's be Fluttershy, because she doesn't suck quite as much as Rainbow Dash. Also, look how big and black their mouths are. That looks kind of ugly. Because their mouth is just this big blackness, and it looks awkward on the background. I wanted to mention on the backgrounds, originally they looked very cluttered and... Like, this background was just all of this black grossness, and it made it kind of hard to tell where the bullets are. But it looks much better now. I assume they must have changed it significantly since I last played, which was like two months ago. But the thing is, you want your background to make it very clear where the bullets are. You want a very clear silhouette of the bullets. So... You don't want a cluttered background, you want a very clear, distinct background, and for whatever reason, this background looks more clearer to me. Anyway. Oh my! I suck! Yeah, you still don't have any interesting lines, do you? Um, I'm Fluttershy. My voice changed. I'm sorry to have bothered you. Blah, 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 blah. Don't barf on me, you sick bastard! <laughs> Why do you look so disturbingly happy? <laughs> that, is, that is messed up, Fluttershy. You. Well, I gained some respect for you for being so messed up, but still. That's messed up. Let's be rarity. Let's murder people. Let's murder people with diamonds. If you're gonna murder people, you better do it in style. That's. That's my philosophy. Unless the police are around, then my philosophy is something non-incriminating. Also, God, can we take any more damage inside of five seconds? Like, really? As I said before, Rarity is the worst 
character to take on its boss ass, but I keep doing it and I don't know why. Also, Rarity's magic attack is like the only good one because it slows bullets. That's like a classic attack or like special ability for bullet hell games. Is that seriously already the ending? Oh, please tell me this game is already over. Uh, every everything you say is perfect, Rarity. I love you so much. You, unlike the other characters in this game, you're not amazingly stupid for whatever reason. I cannot stand being here any longer. I can't either. It's like we're on the same fucking wavelength. We are on the same sparkly, off-white and purple wavelength. If if I wasn't drunk, I could explain to you in hexadecimal what wavelength that would actually be. Not wavelength. What, like, hexadecimal character. Anyway, you don't know what I'm talking about. Never mind. So you're stupid and you don't know about frickin' hexadecimal values. And that that is just embarrassing for you. Anyway, the this... The background's way changed in this level. The backgrounds used to just be stars and blackness. Which, oops. I'm, now I'm Rainbow Dash! Thanks! Me for picking Rainbow Dash. Now I'm gonna suck this entire level. That is... That's pretty much all Rainbow Dash is good for. I mean, not in a disturbing sort of way. In a... She's not... I don't like her in this context of video game. She's just... Yeah. Zevious. Gradius! That is the game I was talking about when I said Zevious all those times. I was talking about Gradius, which is not a bullet hell game. It is a typical shoot 'em up game. This laser would be okay in Gradius. It would not be okay in bullet hell games. At least not in a tricky bullet hell game. Which this is not. At least not on this ridiculously easy difficulty mode. Anyway. These things are all pretty. They're like animated. That's like amazing. Because before, none of the sprites rotated like that. They were just static sprites. It must be a rarity. Because she's awesome. And she does not suck. Unlike Rainbow Dash. Ahem. Anyway. I do really like that rarity has the limited range and extreme damage going on. It makes her a very interesting and fun character to play as. Mostly because she kills things very well. That's... I mean, if there's one reason to love Rarity, it's because she kills things. If there's two reasons to kill Rarity, it's because... Or, to love Rarity, it's because she's fabulous. So, we get to be fabulous and kill things. Those are pretty much the two things to care about in life. I mean, if you kill things and you're fabulous, you pretty much... You're pretty much set for life. So, Rarity is set for life, which is why she's awesome. Also, bullets that shoot bullets are awesome. You call that a boss? I know this is easy mode and all, but I killed that guy's face and like, oops. Now I'm a redneck! See what you did? I was so busy explaining why that boss was too easy that I became a redneck. That's... That is just inexcusable, good sir. Or madam. I don't... I don't know who developed this game. There will be a link in the description if I remember to post it, but like, yeah, I don't know. Now we're stuck in the slow box. See, Applejack, I'm, I'm playing any, any character but Applejack. Preferably Rarity, because she's awesome. But the thing I don't like about Rarity, or Applejack, is that her attack, um, her charge attack is weird. Because of what I explained before. That, you know, you charge up an X amount of apples, but it's, oops. Damn it, Pinkie Pie! I was not in the mood for your whoa. Just, just, just calm down, Pinkie Pie. Anyway, look, another big one. Pinkie Pie has a lot of experience with big ones. Let me tell you, this has to be a big boss too. You have slain many of us. Fuck yeah, I have. You guys are pathetic. <laughs> Pinkie Pie is so excited. It's like, yeah, I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna kill everything. I'm Pinkie Pie. I murder people. Which, which that I expect, I I respect about you, Pinkie Pie. She's she's so happy about the prospect of killing people. I love you, Pinkie Pie. Your reputation precedes you. <laughs> she's so excited about that. Slain, I'm just making cupcakes. You want some? She's 
<laughs> so disturbingly happy about that. It has been decreed that I am to personally stop you. You you look like the boss from the last level. You look exactly like the boss from the last level. Even Pinkie Pie thinks like, what the hell, you're the boss from the last level. What is this crap? Why would you want to stop my party? It is the will of the hybrids. No period. Use punctuation, kids. That's... That's all I can say. The hybrids, they sound like party poop ears. The race of power and dominance. There is no escaping their will. I don't care. Okay? I, I'm just gonna murder you. See, even Piggy Pie is just like, yeah. I'm gonna throw a glamorous murder your face party. We will meet in glorious random capitalization party. There is no reason for meat to be capitalized in that sentence, and I hate you for that. Even though Guile seems playing, I still hate you for that. They've got a generic, very easy to dodge pattern there. So even though we're Pinkie Pie, we're probably still gonna win. Because holy crap, enemies do like no damage in this mode. I probably should have played Derby mode. But, yeah. This is why you shouldn't play Bullet Hell games, guys. This is why you should not play Bullet Hell games while you're drunk. Even while Guile's theme is playing, you might end up in a very easy mode that is ridiculously easy. And I, I do honestly, I'm very glad that you included a very easy game mode, because Bullet Hell games are too hard for most people. I just wanted you to know that Parker is sitting right next to me, he's very offended. Every time I talk, he has his ears back, he's like, what are you doing? Why are you talking so loudly? If I'm talking too loudly, I apologize. He's all like, damn, dude, why are you talking so loud? And if you want to know I'm talking so loud, it's because I'm a freaking redneck. Like freaking Applejack. She's she's redneck pony, that's all I can say about that. She's from the south, and I just... Yeah. Hybrids, this can't be good. Breeding outside of your own family is just unnatural, I say. That was... I'm sorry, I had to say that. That was just too pimp. That was just too perfect. That was the boss! That boss had like eight more forms the last time I fought it. And so, our ponies defeated the incredibly easy alien invasion. I'm sorry for playing the easy mode. And we get... We get a picture. That's what we get for winning. And Applejack is still a redneck. Even though she looks a lot better in that, like, bandana thing, she's still a redneck. And I just can't excuse that. Anyway, let's see how long we last in the hardest mode. And we're still gonna play as Rarity, cause she's... No, Apple! Not... Rainbow Dash! We're not playing as you. Shut up, Twilight. Just... After that Luna's game bullshit with the 50 books, I'm not listening to you ever again. And I know that was the game's creator's fault, because... He sucks and he's terrible. Because... 50 books! 50 books! I hate you. Words... Words cannot express. I could write a book about how much I hate you. And it would not be enough to express... How much... I hate you. Because I really do. Anyway. Okay, I don't like the explodey bullets like that, because it's really not a bullet hell style attack. Because if you're near those, you don't have the chance for micro dodging. And bullet hell is all about micro dodging. So, don't don't do the instant explodey bullets like that. I don't approve of those. Generally, bullets are really slow in bullet hell games. There's just a lot of them. Generally speaking, I would say that there could be about... Okay, reduce the bullet speed by about 50% in this game, and increase the bullet volume by maybe 400%. To make it a real bullet hell game. And stop with the instant spready bullets, because that's not a bullet hell thing. If the... Okay, so... The thing about Bullet Hell games is that generally, you move very slowly to dodge stuff. You make m minuscule adjustments to dodge stuff. I'm gonna die. I'm sorry. But I want to say this. In Bullet Hell games, you make small adjustments and you barely move. The, the whole thing is that you make tiny adjustments and you know exactly where bullets are gonna be. You know exactly where you are gonna be. And that's what it's all about. And you can dodge everything. The difference between that and normal shooters is in normal shooters, you just want to be like, oh, I want to be as far as possible from the shots. But that's boring, stupid gameplay. That's normal shoot-em-up gameplay. I shouldn't disparage it, but 
that's not bu how bullet hell ga gameplay works. If I just stay away from bullets, that's shoot 'em up. If I have to make careful small decisions, that's bullet hell gameplay. And if this game is supposed to be bullet hell, you better you better do the micro dodging thing. I could explain this better if certain situations weren't occurring, but this is the best you have. The game is still lagging. Anyway, that's all I wanted to say. Also, aside from the fact that magic sucks. Magic really sucks in this game, and I want you to fix that. What you tried to do is replace bombs from Toho with magic. Magic is different from bombs. Magic is a common attack that you have a rechargeable meter for. Bombs are a limited time thing that get you out of trouble. And you have like, one bomb maybe clears all of the bullets from the screen. So that's okay for bombs, but you don't mix bombs and magic, because that's fucking retarded. So please don't do that. They're, they're incompatible paradigms. And you know what happens when you mix incompatible paradigms? You're Microsoft, okay? Nobody wants to be Microsoft, except for Microsoft. And the only reason Microsoft works is because people are used to their stupid bullshit. I'm used to their stupid bullshit, but I still hate it. And I'm pretty off topic now, so I should probably end this video. Let's die again, shall we, kids? Let's see what Fluttershy says when she dies. Um. That was awkward. That was really awkward. I guess they're not aiming directly at me. They're aiming around me. Why am I not taking damage? The one time I want to die in this game. Aw, oh, she just cries like a baby. Oh well. This has been... I don't know what this creator wants to call this game. You need to, you need to decide that right now. And you need to only use that name, because goddamn. Oops. I didn't mean to exit the game. But you get a nice view of my desktop. Anyway. You need to decide on what you're going to call your game. And you need to stick with that, because if you're going to call it 5,000 different things, it makes it really hard to find on YouTube. Because you're calling it My Little Pony vs. StarCraft, you're calling it Toho Ponies, you're calling it I don't know what. Just pick one name. Use that. I recommend the name Bullet Hell Ponies. Because that's what your blogger... That's what the blogger account where I found this from calls it. And it's... It's short, it's sweet, it's descriptive, it's not violating copyright. Because holy shit, you're violating lots of copyright. At all times. But still... Bullet Hell Ponies, that's my recommendation. Over and out.